guys welcome back to my channel it's simply nicole passionately promoting positivity in today i just wanted to encourage you guys inspire you guys whoever i can reach and inspire every single day doesn't matter who it is who are however many people it is that is what makes me fulfilled and i believe everyone should be trying to figure out what it is that makes them feel fulfilled in life I'm feeling great about this new setup. Okay, I got some plants here. You guys know the plant trend and it just makes the background look better, honestly. And I have my little positive message here. I finally did my hair. I have a mic now. I just feel great about filming these videos. You know what? We're gonna start off today with a quote. I haven't even read the quote of the day, so let me pull it up and we can read it and discuss it together. The quote of the day is, stay committed to your decisions, but stay flexible in your approach. Tom Robbins. So, yes, committed to your decisions, but flexible in your approach. We all have goals and dreams, or we should, and we know what it is that we're reaching towards. And sometimes we have a set plan in our minds. But you have to understand that you will experience things along that journey that will take you on a different path. and You have to be willing to adjust to that. That's what I learned during my journey, you guys. I took, you know, for four years, I filmed YouTube videos on random topics, let's be honest, vlogs about my life that no one was really interested in, but it was something that I thought was fun and it was a hobby for me. And then I realized how far I wanted to go with this and how strong, how many people I wanted this strong of a voice to reach. And I realized I had to start over. I had to rebrand. And I was flexible in that decision that had to be made. I could have said, you know what? I have to take this path instead of the path that I had set in my mind. This, this must not be meant for me. It must not be meant. But when you have a goal, a vision, and a dream, you know what the end goal is. You know what the end goal is. It's not about, like I said, it's not about numbers or or um, a following or a certain amount of money. It's about your impact and your purpose and the change that you want to see in the world and making that change in people's lives somehow. Because before with my videos, I wasn't making a change in anyone's life, but now I've switched it to, I can make a change in people's lives. And this has to do with what I want to do with my life anyway. So it just makes perfect sense. So you guys do have to be, it is important to be flexible in your decisions and not so set in stone in a certain way that you think your life journey should go. But the title of this video is, you know, you're not dreaming big enough and here's why. And sometimes there's a lot of people that just aren't happy with their lives. You know, no matter how old the person is, people aren't happy with their lives and people don't understand that no matter how old you are, you can change your life because you can change your life. You can change your outcome. You can change your surroundings. You can change what's happening to you in your life. It all starts with changing your mind and healing yourself first they say that everybody should see a therapist um you know whether you're healthy or not even if you're a perfectly normal functioning human being with no mental illnesses you know you should see a therapist to maintain that and i've been hearing that a lot um i always just hear things <laughs> um from different um people that i look up to that are in the coaching industry and it's just okay see a therapist see a therapist and i've never seen one before and i don't think you know, anyone in my family has that has just seen one just to maintain their their perfectly normal mental state. And with me about to enter a new chapter of my life, I am prioritizing seeing a therapist now. I don't see one currently, but that is something I'll be doing because everybody has something that they're suffering with, pain from some source. And I want to figure out how to deal with my pain areas in the best way that I can so that I can move forward and, you know, become my greatest version because you can't hold on to pain. And so back to what I was saying, I just think a lot of people are not happy and they're just content and they're just settling for their life, but they don't realize that it's so easy to change it, guys. I'm not the type of person that would just settle for anything. And I, and I just know my worth so much, and I'm gonna do a video on that as well, but I know my worth so much that I won't settle for anything. It doesn't matter what it is. I've always been like this because I've always known what was for me. I won't settle for anything that is not to my standards. I will keep going until I 
I will keep going until it matches me and until I know that it is worth, like it, like that it's worth it and that it's deserving of my time, my energy. I, you know, I mean, <laughs> most people that, you know, walk around, like I said, are struggling with some type of internal pain. Everybody is. And it's important that that gets healed and taken care of. I would say by a professional. There are things that that I have dealt with that, you know, have affected the way that I am today, the way I'm able to communicate with certain people and express certain things. And I want to get that healed. I want to get that changed because, like I said, I'm going to enter a new chapter of my life soon. We're all going to experience pain that's inevitable, but it's healing from the pain and understanding that you don't have to suffer through that pain that can allow us to change our lives. And I, I know that when it comes to dreaming big, Oh, you know, everybody that has dreamed big or dreams big encounters doubt, whether that's from themselves. I mean, it's, you know, pretty much always from themselves or by people around them. But I just don't understand why people let that stop them from chasing their dream. Because a lot of people, I think what it is, a lot of people will encounter someone, you know, that like a lot of people that have dreams will encounter people that care about them and they'll tell them about their dreams and they'll they'll support them but they'll also caution them and it's just dreamers understand dreamers if you're just not a dreamer you want to understand it may seem like what somebody's reaching for is unrealistic it may seem like what you're reaching for is unrealistic to the next person but what you guys have to understand is okay if this person can do it then why does it seem like why do you feel like I can't do it why do you feel like it's unrealistic for me, but it was realistic and it was for this person. It was this person's reality. But you're saying that since it's not my reality right now, and since you don't see how it could become my reality, then it can never be my reality. And that's not true. I think too many of us are operating from that mindset of, you know, we, we're going by what we see in the moment, but not by what uh, faith can, can get us to and by what perseverance can take us to. So if you can just get past that and not looking at what you see because – what you see really doesn't matter. Like it doesn't really matter because you have to. Um, you're gonna react to, to what happens to you. Okay, you respond to life. Life doesn't just happen to you. It's about how you respond to it, and that's what creates your reality. I I, I just hope that I was able to touch you guys. Now I, I, you know, am making these videos kind of short, but don't worry, okay? Because I'm gonna be trying to upload for the next 30 days consistently, and the videos are gonna be what about eight. 10 minutes, 8 to 10 minutes, 8 to 12 minutes. And then I'm going to start up. I'm going to start talking about other things. Like, I'm just going to see where it goes. I just want to thank every single one of you who watches every video because I know there are some people that watch every video. And thank you to you guys that are supporting me on this new journey, new chapter. Thank you guys, and I'll see you guys in the next one.